Ngai Tahu is gearing up to lead, take the lead in the rebuild of Christchurch. The iwi has just sold $30 million worth of shares in Ryman Healthcare and says rumours the windfall would be spent on state asset shares are incorrect and the rebuild will be a priority. While the iwi prepares to invest its money into the city on the ground, it's also ensuring there'll be Māori muscle to power the reconstruction, as Tahuri Tumwana reports. How many cities you know roll like this? How many cities you know flow like this? Not many, if any. Mai te ru o ruau moko ina tau rua mano te kau te kau mātahi. Kwa noho mai noa te iwi o tautahi. Nā wai i he ka he ke atu. Nā te au au tonu o nā ru me matua turaki nā te haurua o te tao nenei. Ko te mahi nā e nei he mahi rautaki e mahuta ano ai a o tautahi i o napunarihi. Ko he toki ki te rita te kaipapa hau ka whakaara hia, he whakahoki mai ano i nā mahi kāmura e te iwi Māori ki te hana anō i a o tautahi. Mō Joseph Walker, he mea tēnei me matua whai e ia. Um, unemployed at the time, and I heard MTT is about to start up the multi trade training, and that's exactly what I've done since. Inae ne kwa uru ia ki te tira faka nunu ki te hana fare me te ope faka tu ite taone. It's almost like um, a noble thing in which we're doing here, um, and it is starting to work really well. We all know what we're doing. What's our first thing that we want to do here? It's about people changing like what they're doing and it's about having new, I guess, new sort of goals in life. Um, to me, like, what better like, people to have involved with the rebuild than people from here. Ko te pāpā o Joseph Walker, tētahi o nga ākona ōmua i te wā i whakatūria te kaupapa kāmura ki rehua marai i nga tau ono te kau. It's awesome knowing that like um, Dad had a lot of his history here. It would have been part of his training. Um, he was very lucky that he had Fano down here, like Papa Jimmy, um, to support him. You know, he was only 16 when he moved down here, and he's never done anything else since. You know, um, to the day he died, he was a builder. Put a mark on, bro. Hey, Ta Joseph, mate, faka mumuri itu tuki ai te neko papa. It's really hard. You know, I don't have money to go out. Um, sometimes I can't even really afford to to eat. But those are the sacrifices that I made. It does hurt me, like when my daughter needs something, and, and I can't provide it for her. I'm just so lucky that her mother, her mother's whānau, um, if, if they went around, you know, it, it would be a lot harder than it is. He tauira tawhito a Dale McKenzie, nō reira he hoki nā mahara, he koana nā kai mō nā rā o mua i rehua marae. Māori trade training wasn't just about learning how to cut wood or hammer nails. No. You had a lot of fun, uh, enjoyed life, with, we mixed well, we went out together uh, and a lot of people came up to, to Marae itself, to the hostel and used to take us out for lunches and dinners and just to meet us and that was a big thing in those days. Mai nga taurua te kaumātoru o tērā rautau nga mahi poipoi kāmura i kaha hoki mai tēnei kaupapa i muri i te pakana tuarua o te ao Hei whakapakari te huna mahi, hei hana whare mo nga mōre hu hoia. E nari tai atu ki nga tau iwa te kau ka heke haere te taupori o te huna whai te mahi kāmura a ka mate nene hawa tēnei kaupapa. Yeah, I think they, they made the biggest mistake of stopping it. Uh, you know, I, I've seen it with a lot of young boys who are still living back home and, and, and they can't get jobs and they can't, there's no trade training, uh, you can't go to the city to learn. Uh, and yeah, that sort of worries me a wee bit. Hei tā hana e Regan, kāri tuatu i tēnei kaupapa, hei ronoa mō rātou. Nā rere, ko rātou tērā, ka tā ka te ahaere ki te muro o te ahi, ki te aha, ki te whakapaipai, ki te whakarākai, ki te whakatika anō huki i tō mātou taone nei. Nā rere, he tino mahi tērā, e hara i te, e hara i te haka, he mahi no iho tērā, he, he nui te mana o tēnā mahi, kā tahi kā rua, he toki huki ki te mahi, kia eke rātou ki te taumate hea hea te ana. Ko nai tahu tētahi e whai wāhi ana ki nga whenua o tautahi. Ko rātou tonu te manutaki ki te hanawhare ki te whakanunu tānata. It's been a pretty simple process. We've got about 470 kids registered. There's 173 in the classroom. Last year was a bit slow. We only had a 33% 
success rate, but 50 of them are still back in, uh, going through it again. So the big hurdle is when the rebuild actually starts. Kei te tū hoka hoka nei o Naitahu, kua whakarite e rua mano na tekihana heihana whare. Aha koa te rika rika o nga mahi, kei te noho tārewa tonu nga mahi ki rō taone. We're picking that it probably won't kick off until the end of this year, early next year. So we've got the kids in the classroom, our job is to keep them engaged until the jobs come up. We've been successful in getting 20 kids into apprenticeship so far. Not enough, of course, we want the whole the whole lot done, but until that rebuild actually kicks off, it is going to be slow. E nari ki a tīmata nā mahi, kua whītiki, kua rite a Joseph me o nga hoako ki te mahi i te mahi.